Things very looking good out there at Elmer Thomas Park. Cameron University President John MacArthur has announced his retirement, which was accepted by the Board of Regents last Friday. Now, after being with the university for 20 years, he has big plans for his retirement. 7 News reporter Jonathan Lewis sat down with President MacArthur to discuss how he feels about his time at Cameron and what's to come. I've been at Cameron since uh, the summer of 2004. I had the opportunity to come here as the Dean of Science and Technology, and then two years later uh, became the Chief Academic Officer uh, here. And since uh, July of 2013, I have had, had the great fortune to be president of this institution. The summarized version of a 20-year journey for the now retiring university president, John MacArthur, one that was full of many lessons along the way. MacArthur recalls his time before being named president and how his vision would be developed over time. I, we were always building something going forward uh, and it taught me to imagine the place that this could become and, and not be uh, bound by what it had always been uh, before. So it was an exciting time. It's still an exciting time. Over the last decade serving in the role, MacArthur gained many accomplishments, none of which he takes full credit for, telling us where much of his understanding sourced from and guidance for the university. Student input, and I, I think that, that was a big part of it, is listening to their aspirations, what they wanted to accomplish, you know, why they were pursuing a degree, and then how could we shape Cameron to better suit their needs. While president, MacArthur completed two five-year strategic plans for the university, achieved an increase in enrollments and concurrent enrollments, added seven new degree programs, six certificate programs, 29 micro-credentials, created a number of programs to assist students not only in academics, but with life issues, added three new intercollegiate sports, made improvements to the Aggie added gym, lights to the baseball and softball hitting cages, added an esports arena, a broadcasting space in the academic commons, and also added the university greenhouses. Hold on, there's more. He added 12 new faculty positions, 88 scholarships, and increased the balance of endowed funds by 50%. He's actually accomplished much more over time, but of all the achievements... I, I think the biggest accomplishment is continuing to add well-educated citizens to Oklahoma, I, particularly to southwest Oklahoma, so they continue to, to, to work, live, raise their families here, and, and make this a great place to live. After at least 3,650 days as president and so many things completed, MacArthur says his favorite memories come each year with a specific day and for a selfless reason. Commencements. Far and away the best day I, every year. I mean, there, and there are so many great days, but that's a big one because, you know, you see the students completing a part of their academic journey. That sense of uh, anxiety, but also that sense of excitement about future possibility. That makes it such a special day. A 20-year journey full of learning and leadership will now lead to the beginning of a life much different than the one President John MacArthur is leading right now. Retirement has at least two very specific objectives to complete. Number one, probably to say yes ma'am to my wife for, for at least six months. I, I, again, I've spent so much time uh, putting Cameron first. I, I, I'm looking forward to having a, a, a bit more time with family. And number two, to travel more. I, I, I get to travel a bit as president but not so much leisure travel, and there's so much of this world I've, I've yet to see, and I'm looking forward to exploring again. MacArthur says to whoever is named the next president, Cameron University is a special place with much to learn, and that he hopes they continue to listen to the community to best shape the university and to what the people truly need, rather than push their own agenda. He also says he values the affordability of the university and hopes the incoming president will as well, continuing to make Cameron University one of the most affordable institutes in the state. President MacArthur's retirement begins in June, and we wish him congratulations and safe travels. Reporting for 7 News, I'm Jonathan Lewis.